Preamble of Indian Constitution We, the people of India, have solemnly resolved to constitute India into a sovereign, socialist, secular, democratic republic and to secure to all its citizens justice, social, economic and political, liberty of thought, expression, belief, faith and worship, equality of status and of opportunity and to promote among them all fraternity assuring the dignity of the indigent and unity and integrity of the nation. In our Constituent Assembly this 26th day of November 1949 do hereby adopt, enact and give to ourselves this constitution. American constitution was the first to begin with a preamble. India adopted this method from the USA. Technically, preamble is the introduction or preface to the constitution. In India, preamble is the heart and soul of the constitution. Preamble is a key to open the edifice of the constitution. Preamble declares the mind and objectives of the constitution makers. Preamble declares that the sovereignty or supreme power in India belongs to the people. Jawaharlal Nehru is the architect of the preamble. The base of the preamble was objective resolution. The preamble has been amended only once. By the 42nd Constitutional Amendment Act of 1976, three new words were inserted into the preamble. They are socialist, secular and integrity. The date mentioned in the preamble is 26th November 1949. According to the preamble, India is a sovereign socialist, secular, democratic and republic country. K. M. Munshi called preamble as the political horoscope. N. A. Palkiwala called preamble as the identity card. Ernest Barker said preamble is the key to the constitution. Thakudas called preamble as the heart and soul of the constitution. Jawaharlal Nehru said preamble is the soul and key to the constitution. 